80 miles an hour down into the heart of turn one. It's really a deceleration zone for turn two, and here we are, still downshifting, 40 miles an hour, and launch out of there, incredible grip and traction. The engine singing its head off, up to 140 before braking for turn three and four. This is an important corner. Just up against the wall, he got away with that. Five is easily full throttle. Right hand side, heavy braking, turn six. You must collect the curb on the left. It's like a railway line pulling the car around. Now, avoid the wall on the exit and you're away. Up to 180 miles an hour. It's narrow, bumpy. Just under the bridge, there's a shadow where we're going to brake hard. The back of the car will be dancing around. He steers it beautifully across those two curves. That was absolutely perfect. We're on our way down to the hairpin, 180 miles an hour, get the car straight, press the brake pedal very hard, five times the force of gravity, we're slowing that, he just hooked up with the apex. Now Fernando Alonso is just behind us, he is also on a hot lap, he's one tenth of a second faster to this point, it's all about the crucial final chicane, 200 miles an hour, we're looking for a braking point, 100 metres before the corner on the left hand side, now he's going to launch it in, 80 miles an hour, he flies across the curb, scoops up the rear sliding, just misses the wall and he's on his way to the line, that was crucial and it gave him pole position.